Okay, in this video, let's talk about support real quick. First of all, if you're using a PC or an Android phone or tablet, we highly recommend use the Google Chrome browser. If you're using a Mac, an iPhone, or an iPad, we recommend using the Safari browser. The only browser we recommend you stay away from is Firefox. Firefox has been known for years to be very, very unstable. Now let's look at our support over here in the left hand side, this menu. And again, if you're using the tablet or the uh, phone version of the site, and you need to tap on this box here with the horizontal lines to display the menu. There are two links here I want to point out to you. One is the training audios. If you click on that, it opens up our training audios archive. And you can find training on all the, the, the nine live calls we do every week. We record five of those nine calls. And you can find the most recent calls are at the top. And just scroll down and go to the other pages. And you'll see them chronologically listed. If you want to... Uh, see the oldest calls, just click on the date uh, carrot here and it'll rearrange everything by oh never mind that's been changed but you can uh, re you can sort everything by title going from the uh, uh, lowest in the alphabet to the highest or from the highest to the lowest you can sort by category you can sort by speakers or by tags. And when you find an audio you want to listen to, just click on the blue play and view details. To play the audio, you can just click on this play button and the audio will start playing. If you want to download the MP3 to listen offline or on, on your phone or iPod, you can just download it here. And then there's some details about the call. And if there are any links or notes, the links will be at the bottom here, and that'll open up uh, notes in a new website. Then just click the back button to go back to the menu. If you are searching for something specific, you can use this filter. For example, maybe you want to uh, find training that Sarah Thompson did. You just start typing Sarah's name, and then you'll see it'll automatically bring up uh, the uh, calls that uh, Sarah was uh, involved with or maybe you're looking for a topic like blogging and just start typing blog and everything that has to do with blogging will show up so it's a very very powerful search feature now down here in the support section there's two items the first is the status updates and here uh, we, we put information about updates, uh, new changes to the system, what's going on, what's running. Sometimes there are some instructional videos embedded here. And if you have a challenge, if you find a bug, click on Report Issues, and you can create a ticket. Now, first thing is uh, the category of problem. You could be uh, sending a compliment, and we highly recommend you send your compliments in there. You know, the people who work on the system, the programmers and administrators, love compliments. You know, they like to hear good things, too. If you have any suggestions, click on Suggestions. If you just have a question, click on Question. And if there's a problem, you want to report a bug, click on Report Bug. And then in the next drop down, uh, select the service is it the mentoring app the boot camp your personal site thinking for rich lessons or something else and then just briefly type your uh, message here and when you're done click submit and your report ticket will be sent in uh, should there uh, you'll receive an email at your email that you use to register for the boot camp if there are any questions or follow-up from the support staff they will contact you by email and it's just that simple oh I should point out one more thing let's go back to the dashboard down the very bottom here is a section called quick links quick links that uh, take you to other 
websites like you can log into your Facebook from here Twitter uh, LinkedIn or whatever and you can add your links at, at any time just click on the ad and then you can pick an icon name the link and then put the URL for the link in there so any websites that you visit frequently or that you use to work your marketing efforts you can have a real quick link here down in your quick links section makes it very convenient it will open up these sites in a new window or tab so you can do your work and then come back to your dashboard so it turns this app into uh, like kind of like a hub the um, phone or tablet version of the website does not have the quick links. This will only appear on a PC or Mac version at this time. And that's our support in a nutshell. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next video.